I'm John. Welcome to the J&J Auto Wrecking Test video of what I hope is our 2003 Honda S2000. I was down here doing something else. It's not quite closing time yet. I had a jump box on me, so I decided to fire this girl up. Beautiful silver car, uh, real low mileage. I just forgot it, even though I just got out of it. 71,000 miles. Seats are very nice. It came with a piece of a legit, a legit raised wheel. So that's kind of interesting. I wonder if he hit something, JDM. Do a walk around here. AC's even running, that's super cool. The heart of the beast, man. One of the best sounding four cylinder motors in existence. I'm letting it get warm so we can do the thing. The longer I talk, the warmer that motor gets and the better we are going to be to it. Uh, passenger side obviously smashed up. The convertible top is good. I don't see any issues with it. A little bit of sun fading. We can clean that up. Man, it sucks to see this car totaled. Huge fan of these. I know they're just skyrocketing in value. Yeah, OEM. OEM as can be. That's how we like them. All right, let's step inside here and test some parts. Uh, all right, yep, this is why I didn't buy one of these back in the day. It doesn't work. It just does not work at all for me. For a client, it's bearable. Let her get warm. Okay, let's slowly test some parts. Ooh, dome light's on. Uh, all right, what do we start with? The mirrors, driver's side. Passenger side. Climate control. There we go. Power windows. Hey, passenger side's no bueno. Is it locked out? It is. Old school Honda window switches for the wind. Uh, convertible roof, let's see how that functions. Always an important thing to test in a S2000 video. We're free. Do I gotta be touching the brake? Oh, e-brake. Oh, it got hung up. Son of a gun. Every time I do one of these, this happens. Is this a thing, S2000 owners? Let me know in the comments. I can never get this thing to do it right. Okay, so you gotta go back, that's what it is. I'm a nincompoop. This is why I can't own one of these. All right, convertible top works. Let's relatch this thing back up. Now, I've tested a lot of convertibles in my six years doing this, and the S2000 may be the easiest kind of manual-esque top I've ever had to deal with. That latch system, that's true Honda right there. You don't really get that in anything else. GMs, you got these big dumb levers. Even like a C5 Corvette target top is not the easiest thing to get on and off. It's worth like a bunch of money and it just, yeah, I don't know, they didn't figure it out. Okay, rant over, hopefully it's warm enough. We gotta hear this thing. Achievement not unlocked. I really need it to get warm so we can go higher. Let's warm, let's warm it up a little bit. Simulated load. Well, regardless, this motor is very stock. There's no exhaust on it, not even an aftermarket, you know, wheel wiener, air cleaner, which these things are so famous for. And the Hellcats. You pop the hood and there's just a big old carbon fiber coming at you. We've abused the old F20C enough. It's actually, it's fine. It's it's honestly fine. It's been running for five minutes now. Oh, I'm going to leave it running though because I gotta take photos of it. So yeah. All right guys, 
I am John. This has been the J&J Auto Wrecking Test Video of our Silver Honda S2000 AP1. If you guys are looking for S2000 parts, we just got two fresh ones in, depending on when you're watching this video. But we got a super clean AP1 behind me and a super clean AP2 that we just did. Uh, that the Delfino Red or whatever. I don't believe that's the right name of it. But regardless, it was a Red 07. It's nice. If, uh, check out the video. It should probably be one or two below me. Or head on over to our website. I'm John at J&J Auto Wrecking. Check yourself before you wreck yourself. Bitcoin saves your wealth. Jesus saves your soul. Thanks for watching.